Good evening. Hello, good evening, welcome. How are you doing? Are you guys okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Great, great. How are you? I'm fine too, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing great, I think so, yeah. Yeah, when you have a lot to do, I think you have to organize yourselves, but yourself better to, uh, I mean, make like a discharge of stress, right? <laughs> yeah. uh, mm -hmm. Yes, because we are used to the, uh, the hurry every day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I'm happy that you are here. Very uh, punctual. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate this. I see Hosman. I see what well, Lorena said she was going to be as a listener tonight. And also Boris, right? He will be as a listener. Carlos Ernesto, are you available? Rafael Alexander, hello. Edwin Antonio, hi. Hi, teacher. How are you doing, Edwin? I'm fine, teacher. Great, great. Teacher, hey, tell me a question. This is our second week or third week of class? This is this the month? third. This is the third week. The third. This is the third week. The third week. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. This is the third week, but we cover unit two and two weeks. That's why you feel this kind of long, right? Because it's five weeks um, course mm -hmm. this is a uh, five weeks course mm -hmm. yeah, uh, i was working in the different homework mm -hmm. and section section two was the longer yeah yes so, because we have two video classes and then the homework two video classes and then the homework yes mm -hmm. Yes, I was encouraging encouraging you to work in advance in the platform as a manner of um, being, let's say, punctual with the times. Actually, we we could finish this week, but can I can mm -hmm. I tell you something? Tell me, <laughs> tell me, tell can, me. Can... Uh, I, I will show you something. Okay, tell me. Look. Great, yes. Yes, good. Yesterday I can't sleep and I was working. <laughs> <laughs> but this is good news, Miguel. Yes, congratulations. But, well done. Well but, done, yes. Mm -hmm. and, this uh, is what we expect. In, uh, in, in unit four, I guess I don't remember. Uh -huh. But one homework was for me was too difficult, and mm -hmm. he he is only multiple selection. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that mu know. multiple choice. Uh -huh. Multiple choice. I don't know why it was so difficult to me. Uh huh. But, but you did it. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Great. You oh. investigate. Hello, good evening, teacher. Hello, good I, evening, Boris. I I, I go to uh, drive driving. All right, no problem. Drive and keep your eyes on the road. All right, and as soon yeah. as you get to your destination, then you let us know to participate. All right. Oh yes, gracias. Okay, no uh, problem, no problem, Boris. Go ahead. Have a good trip. Okay, well, I'm so happy with that with that news. Um, let's see. I think we are. I mean, there are some of us ready. Okay, I see Ulisse, uh, Carlos Alberto too, and Elias. Very good. So we are going to start the class by doing our feedback. Remember that our feedback is really important because we recall the concepts 
the terms, the vocabulary, and also some concepts that maybe we didn't understand at the, at the beginning and in the feedback we comprehend better. That is why we need our feedback to continue under the same topic because we are still in marketing, okay? Uh, we are studying the marketing mix and at this moment, remember they are for peace. So at this moment, we are still stuck on promotion strategies. We are going to see just a little bit about the place of strategies. And also then we are going to continue with the promotion strategies because yesterday we saw promotion strategies, but we didn't see some elements of the place, okay, of the place um, strategies. Remember that the main objective of any company is to make profits, right? What is the main purpose of doing a good marketing plan? What do you think, guys? What is the purpose of creating a good marketing plan? Uh -huh. um, well, maybe position in the brand and sell the product. Very good. That's the main purpose, right? To sell, to um, make profits, right? To feed the needs, profitable, okay? Uh, let's see. We know that we have four Ps. One is for product. And then price, product, price, promotion, and place. Place and promotion, <laughs> yes. And as, um, as I mean, the best way we can combine these elements, the better profits we're going to get, okay? So this is the purpose of a very good marketing mix application, okay? What is a strategy? Do you know what is a strategy? Mm -hmm. Strategy is association. I can be association uh, with a new idea or strawberry. I know. Or when people have a lot of idea about the new product. Mm -hmm. Okay. So as when people have a, a new idea for creating a new product and introducing it to the market, right? Uh, to make it available for the target market and then uh, having the revenues back, okay? To complete the cycle, right? To complete the cycle. So strategy is exactly that. The way we are going to plan the elements that we are going to use, the tools we are going to need, the money we are going to invest, okay? And the way we're going to act according any of the elements is behaving in the market, okay? For example, we say the offer or the supply, right? The supply and demand supply and demand we we could say well if there is not much of that product then the price is going to increase but if there is a lot of that product available anywhere 
then, and anyone is offering it, then the price is going to decrease. Okay, it's going to be low. And marketing works moving and the behavior of that demand, right? We offer a product or we withdraw a product with some strategies to survive in a saturated market, in a saturated market. So we work marketing, creating strategies, right, to a, have a, a company that um, takes back the money they need, okay? Or the profits that they are expecting to earn or to make, all right? These are like the most important um, points in marketing, right? We created strategies in a business plan, integral, right? This is integral. Okay, this is talking about yesterday, but now let's go and continue talking about yesterday. Yesterday we were trying to recognize they place and promotion elements in the strategies, right? So let's take a look on the material from yesterday. Okay, Hosman, what can you tell me about the promotion strategies? Just um, when you see this slide, what do you remember? What do you remember here? Imagine you are explaining to the whole class what promotion strategies are. Okay, Hosman? Okay. Um, I remember the personal selling uh, and branding, uh, social media, website, special eventing, digital marketing, brochure newsletter, advertising, um, PR. Um, this, um, um, the last night, I built the personal steel, the example, the personal steel, the um, and sale the catalog, catalog, mm -hmm. catalog. Yes, yeah. catalog, catalog. Catalog, catalog. Um, in the branding, remember the the imaging, the the company. This this uh this is remember to to element and social media and for me this the other day is the 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 sales in the website or online. Omnicanalidad, this is made in the company, for example. Okay. Uh, the other side, for example, uh, website is the uh, based on live, right? Is the the comp uh, order day the uh, whole company is necessary because the expression the 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 information the company other the sale the product. This is in website. A special events and um, participation of the company in different activities. Uh, for example, uh, concert, um, event publics. This public is events. Public, public events. Public events. This is the promotion that made the company. Right? And the, because the the consumer view the, the name, it is on the, for the promotion of the marketing, the, um, se como se diría, boca en boca, um, person to when, person, okay. person to person, person right? to person, okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. This is an official event, um, direct marketing, 
the activities that is necessary or necessary on the part time and the company uh, the view the activities for the sales promotion place and other elements necessary the company um brochure and newsletter um, advertising i don't know um, the, the the definition the the elements huh? okay <laughs> brochures and newsletter brochures are oh, okay. these uh flyers yeah, that you give flyers, with information yeah, yeah about your yeah. products and promotion for example in, in the in the in the um campaign campaign in campaign is this the promotion the product for example or the information the credit or Oh, I got a lot of information necessary to the consumer, right? This is in brochure. He okay. advertising, I don't know. <laughs> the publicity. Publicity oh, is, okay. yeah. Okay. Advertising are the commercials on TV, on the radio, oh, okay. or maybe on the newspapers, right? Mm -hmm. No. That's advertising. Definition of advertising, no, I don't know because the, the, <laughs> no tenía claro la definición de advertising. Okay, well, that's advertising, the commercials, okay, the, okay. Com the messages you send to get, uh, I mean, to make your product um, acknowledgeable, right, to the people. Okay. Uh, or to the person you are selling to. And PR is public relations, okay? This PR is public relations and that's to build the image or uh, let's say the relations between the different publics uh, with the company from the company to the public and the interns, right? The interns, the environment in the company. So public relations create relations and it's in charge of being the support of the information to the public, okay? Information of all our activities as a company. Uh, they are always in charge of creating special events, okay? They create the special events as a marketing department too, okay? As a marketing department too, but public relations involves, involves to, um, to create the relation with a feedback to vice, okay? to vice and marketing is one. And the answer is that the people buy the product, but PR are the relation uh, that I send a message and I receive an answer. I, they reply, okay, this is a relation. This is communication. Okay, then uh, thank you very much, Hosman. Thank you. You did a very good job explaining each element. So now, guys, is there any example you remember from yesterday when we talk about the promotion strategies? Do you remember what your classmates explained to? Let's see. Um, Mr. Kevin. Kevin? Yes, teacher. Okay, uh, can you give us an example of a promotion strategy with one national product? Uh, yesterday we were talk about the Mr. Donuts and the promotion strategies and of Mr. Donuts is advertising on on tv on banners on radio and and all the people wait 
this uh, September in each year mm -hmm. uh, to buy donuts. Uh, they, uh, Mr. Donuts, have a complete promotion strategy. Okay, very good. Thank you very much, Kevin. Thank you. So now let's talk about the place strategies because the place and strategies, uh, we just said that it was about the location, right? The location, but it's not only the location. These are the activities that you do to make this product available because not always we offer a product in a physical place. Maybe we just have a warehouse and we deliver directly to the consumer's houses. So it's not only a, the physical place like an office or a store for some for some companies, but there are other companies like the supermarkets, banks, mm, I don't know, what can you say? Mm, hospitals, private hospitals. Mm, can you give me any other example of a, the kind of business that for sure they need a physical place? A ver. Productos o compañías que sí necesitarían tener un lugar físico. A ver. Por ejemplo, the restaurants. Restaurants, yes. Restaurants. Mm -hmm. Banks. Banks. Yes. Hotels. Hello, Rafael. You said something? Um, yes, teacher. Hotels. <laughs> hotels. Yes, hotels. Airbnb, right? <laughs> hotels. Mm -hmm. Any other that comes to your mind? Store the clothing. Yes, clothing stores. Clothing stores. Clothing store. Mm -hmm. Okay. There are some of these uh, businesses that they, when, we, when they create, let's say, let's say this way, when they create their physical business, Aside, they have they, their online business too, right? And it's a manner to uh, move the stock to the turnover, right? And remember, I don't know if you know banana. Have you ever heard banana? Have you ever heard banana in El Salvador? ¿Han escuchado esa compañía, banana o oh, bananas? It's not really. Actually, they sell everything of beauty. It's like a um, beauty supply. Okay, it's a beauty supply, and they offer these products for the beauty salons or for um, they do it in a retail price too. Price too. So it's not only by dozen or by bulk, by boxes, big quantities, large quantities, but they also sell by unit or per unit, mm, the products. As long as I know, they have a place, right? They have a physical place, but aside and they, did the, the business through Facebook, through the internet, and they create these kind of spots, really short and um, 
explaining how to use one of the products they sell. They are all imported, right? They are all imported. So suddenly, suddenly, I thought when I needed something from that uh, store, I told my husband, uh, please go directly to the address and the phone, they, I mean, the address, the physical address, they are uh, informing in their spot. And when we went over there, he told me, it's not a store, it's just a warehouse, right? It's just a warehouse. So they don't have for, uh, they don't have a display room. They have just the stock over there and they are not using the uh, enhancement in their physical place. So how are they using their promotion strategies? only by social media. This was really interesting case. This was a really interesting case because they don't have a physical place where you can go and buy like a store, but they have distributors. They have distributors. And when you go to the distributors houses, I mean, stores, you are going to find a different thing totally different, but if you buy directly to Bananas, you are not going to find a physical place. So if we talk about the play strategies from them, I think they are making the products available by the social media, okay, as they did in the promotion, right? The social media, they make special events, they do it through the websites, okay? They are branding because they say bananas, okay? They say the name bananas, but they also um, describe the product um, as its function, not as the name of it, okay? Or as the brand of each product. Ellos no comercializan los productos por una marca de el producto, sino que todos los productos, aunque sean de la marca que sea, ellos ponen en alto o, o, o eh, ponen su nombre, ¿verdad? Bananas, aunque el producto sea marca, ay, no sé, vamos a decir maripositas, ¿verdad? Eh, pero su, su marca es bananas. Y ustedes lo van a encontrar en social media, websites, pero no tienen un physical place. But they make available the product for people. They deliver to your house, they deliver to your business, they deliver anywhere you want. And also they provide, they, um, supp they supply, they, um, they are the suppliers of beauty salons, right? Beauty salons. And they don't have a physical place where you can go and choose what you want. It's an interesting case, it's an interesting case. All right, and um, let's go and repeat reading this, okay? We said, promotion strategies is creating a channel for conversation with the target market. Conversation. Conversation needs a feedback, okay? Needs a feedback. You send a message, but you are expecting for a feedback with the target market through promotion, the company aims to attract the customer's attention and give them enough information about the product to foster interest and motivate them to purchase. A ver, vamos a ver por ahí. ¿A quién tenemos? Está por ahí. Eh, Carlos Ernesto, are you available? Edwin, are you available? Yes, it's your. Okay, please read this quote. Okay. It is creating a channel for the conversation with the target market. Through promotion, the company aims to attract the customers attraction, and give them enough information about the product to force authors interest and motivated motivate them to purchase. Okay, so here we go. 
We are going to go to our uh, manual and we are going to read a conversation we've got there on, just one second. Page 21, I think, if I'm not wrong. No, 22, I'm sorry. Page 22. On page 22, we have a conversation. And remember, place and promotion, they have to be together, okay? Together completely. Uh, they complete the mix, right? They complete the mix together. But um, we have two questions right there. What is the process from the producer to the intended user called? What is the process of moving products from the producer to the intended user called? Mm -hmm. I don't know if you have it. One second, I, I will share this for you. Teacher, mm -hmm. I don't understand uh, the last words. Intended user code. Intended user is um, the one who is going to use it, okay? And hold, hold is a, eh, que estamos oh. preguntando cómo se llama ese proceso. The process called. Mm -hmm. oh, yo pensé que era called de llamada, por eso. Oh, no, no, no. no. Yeah, thank you. Okay, allow me just to send the question to you. I will send it through the chat and then we're going to um, say it all together in the manual. Okay, this is the question. Okay. Do you know? The answer, a ver, leamos bien la pregunta. What, sorry, what is the process of moving products from the producer to the intended user? If we think about the process, we should go to the a slide I showed you about the way of moving the products, remember. Like this one, okay? How do we call this process of moving the products from the producer to the consumer? Yeah. We are moving it to the wholesaler, then we move it to the retailer, then we move it to the consumer. The final consumer receives it. Now, in the second one, we move the product or the producer moves the product to directly to a retailer, right? And then to a consumer. But now, directly from the producer to the consumer, Okay, there are three kind of processes, but let's say the first one will be the most um, complete one, okay? The most complete one because um, you are moving products from one to, uh, from A to B, B to C, C to D, okay? But what, how, I mean, what are these processes called? What are these processes called? And the pen teacher, the, the for the all the process, the and the arrival, the product of the consumer, 
for example, in the in the free in the first case, produce, wallet, wallet seller, retailer, and consumer. Is this an is uh, scala? Mm -hmm. Scale. Hell, uh, 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 because the different price, price, for example, um, for example, uh, import and product, the other company uh, sell it the uh, um, wall seller, next the, the retailer and the consumer. Mm -hmm. This, uh, uh, for me, yeah, mm -hmm. is on case, is different, it's the uh, Producer, the mm -hmm. producer, producer, mm -hmm. and the retailer and consumer. For example, mm -hmm. a company is the the products meal. Mm -hmm. For example, is mm -hmm. the, the uh, producer and the retailer and the consumer. Mm -hmm. For this is a, a canal. okay. You say yeah, channel. Uh -huh. chance, you say, for example, your product is milk, okay? Let's milk. say that this is milk, okay? What we are going to produce. Yeah, and all dairy products, I assume, right? Uh, all dairy products. And you want to take this milk and this products I produce, I mean, we produced to the final consumer, okay? Mm -hmm. To the final consumer yeah let's say consumer here yeah <laughs> it seems like a letter e i'm sorry guys i'm not so uh, good drawing in the computer consumer oh let's say customer too right consumer Aha, but let's say that I have the milk right here, but imagine that I have a wholesaler here, another wholesaler here, another wholesaler, and then I have a retailer here, and then another retailer, and this final consumer doesn't go to the, to the factory, okay? He goes to that supermarket let's say supermarket okay they get their milk at the supermarket mm -hmm. what are all the activities i have to do to make this product available to the final consumer for example i will take the for okay my milk goes to the wholesalers okay the wholesalers then the wholesaler sell it to the retailer. This is another supermarket, okay? And another store. Maybe this is a store mm, de la Niña Menche or Doña Evelyn, right? And we're going to take this over here. So the retailer is going to take them right here, right? Okay. Then if we say, mm, this is a retailer or a supermarket, yeah, a supermarket that sells for Doña Mercedes, ¿verdad? Imagínense que ella no va a comprar para revender en una compañía grande, sino que ella va a ir a comprar a un supermercado donde ya tiene el negocio, ¿verdad? De que le vende a las tienditas, digamos, ¿ok? So, all these activities eh, are part of a process of moving the product from one place to another place to make the product available for the final consumer. What is all this process of moving the products and uh, make it available for the final consumer? What is it called? What is it called? A ver, me voy a traer la pregunta para acá, just to remember the question. Oops.
Hmm. Okay, what is the process of moving the products or products from the producer to the intended user code? All this process, all this process. Here we are talking about the distribution channels. We are talking about, uh, sorry, transportation. Okay, storage. Okay, we are talking about all of this. Storage, distribution channels. So, and marketing, all this process as a part of the marketing mix will be, I will write it over here. This process is called lace. Okay, place. And in Spanish, we have it more clear, okay, or clearer. ¿Por qué lo tenemos más claro? Porque nosotros no lo traducimos como location o como lugar, sino que lo traducimos como plaza, ¿verdad? Plaza. Y o hablando de plaza, pues estamos hablando de el movimiento en el mercado, ¿verdad? Entonces, uh, let's say, place is not the place, I mean, the physical place, it's talking about all the process of moving the product to the final consumer. That's place, okay? That's place. Are we okay? A ver, ¿quién me puede explicar esto? What is the process of moving products from the producer to the intended user called. A ver, un voluntario. Was it Carlos Alberto? Uh, teacher is a uh, similar similar uh, call center. Like a call center? When you order a product? Yes. Mm -hmm. If you order a product, maybe you are doing it like by phone, right? By phone, you are ordering the product and also you are making this available for the customer. Yes, of course, of course. It's part of the process. But the whole process of moving a product from the producer to the final consumer is called place, okay? It's called place. And the call center is a very good example too. A ver, voy a volver a hacer la pregunta y me dicen la respuesta. La respuesta es solo esto, miren. Okay, vamos a ver. What is the process of moving products from the producer to the intended user called? Place. 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 Very good. Very good. Now, uh, we are going to try to do the question to another classmate, okay? A ver, comencemos que tengo a Josman aquí cerquita, ¿verdad? Josman, usted escoge a un compañero. You choose a classmate and you ask this question. All right? And so on, the chain, ¿verdad? El que responda va a volver a decir la misma pregunta y a, escoge a quién. All right? Ok, teacher. Uh... Edwin Quinteros. What is the process of moving product from the producer to the in intent user call it? Intended. 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 It's intended place. user call it. Mm. 
Hello, Edwin. It's place. All right, now you choose another classmate and ask the same question. Um, let me see. Wilbur. Okay. What is the process of moving product from the producer to the intent user called? Intended. Intended. Place. Okay, now you choose another one. Kevin Alfredo. Yes. Okay. What is the process of moving products from the producer to the intended user called? It's place. Okay. Um, Boris Alexander. Uh, he's just a listener right now. Okay. Rafael. Or Nelson, Nelson. Okay. Uh, what is the process of moving products from the producers to intended user code? It's place. Very good. Now you choose another classmate, Nelson, and ask the same question. Okay. Let me see. Jose Salvador. Are you there? Mister, yeah. There he is. Okay, no problem. No problem, Salvador. All right. Okay. Eulise? Yes, I'm here. Ah, okay. What is the process of moving products from the producer to the intended user called? It's a place. Okay, now you okay. choose another person, Eulise, and ask the same question. Okay, let me see. Hmm. Rafael, are you there? <laughs> okay, what is the process of moving pros products from the produce to in the in the intended use of coal? Um, this place. Very good. Now, Rafael, you are going to give me the definition of place. It's the process of mowing products from the produce, producer to the intended user. Great, Rafael, yes. So everybody, what is place then? Place is the process of moving products from the producer to the intended user. It means that it involves all the activities to make the product available for the target market. Okay, great. Thank you very much, everybody. Now let's go and let's read these. Um, of their question, it says, how important is placement to reaching the right target audience? How uh, important is the placement? I will write the word here, placement, okay, placement. Uh -huh. Poner, verdad, o el lugar que ocupa, o ponerlo en el lugar, that's placement. So allow me to share the screen again. And let's go to, okay, here we've got it. How important is placement to reaching the right target audience? A ver, ideas. Edwin, what do you think? How important is placement for, I mean, to reaching the right target audience? So uh, because this can help to the producer uh, has more profit. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Where they felt proud because the placement, the placement uh, could be the necessary to to achieve the to achieve the goals. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, mm -hmm. For example, for example, let's say one goal of putting in the right place a product for the target market. Um, what could be a, a goal? Uh, this is depend the product they can they want to sell. For exactly. example, in the product market, could be if. Is a toy. The product market could be the the boys, the children, and if the product is for the kitchen or the or another place in the house, and this could be um, the woman, uh -huh. the women, sorry, and in I don't know. Is... Yeah, but you're right. You're right. Completely right. And it depends. How are you going to offer things like cosmetics only for men? It's not, it's not that possible because the intended user uh, are women. So maybe the men can be a customer because they can buy products for a woman, right? But you are going to... Um, place the product according to your target market, right? And it will help you to uh, make more profits as you said before. So thank you very much, Edwin. Very good. Mm -hmm. Now let's read this conversation. It says that Sophia is discussing some ideas about the place to distribute her product. Read the conversation and then we are going to go to the breakout room to practice this conversation. It says, I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. Okay, now let's think over here about the place they are talking about, but at the same time, they are talking about promotion here. So let's read the conversation for 30 seconds, everybody. Okay, if you have questions, let me know. Richard, how, how do you pronounce an awareness? Just like that, awareness. Awareness, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. Awareness. Good. And in the course or or in the courses? Uh, one course, two courses. Um, enough interesting in the courses in the okay. courses mm -hmm. okay. yes in the courses any more questions Okay, then let's listen to Eulise and uh, let's say here, 
Elias, please role play the conversation. Uh, okay, but who? You are Sophia, and Arnold will be a. Um, a Oh, Me the Elias, yes. Thank you, Elias. I would like to sell training courses online. I have development a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a story to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by asset? Access. 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 Okay. You could sell your training course online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. There, this is great because you can create our uh, how do you say that? Awareness, 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 create awareness about your product from social network sites, social network sites, and create an out interested in the course so that people will buy them. Okay, thank you very much. Let's refine some pronunciation here. Let's see. Uh, at the beginning, we said sell training courses, training courses, right? Training courses. And then we have the word developed. Look, developed. It's an ed ending with a, an an unvoiced a consonant at the end, develop. So it's developed with a letter T, developed, developed. And then let's see, it says irrelevant, eh, irrelevant, irrelevant. Then we have advantage, advantage. When we have a letter N and a letter T, usually we don't pronounce the letter T. We just pronounce the letter N and let's say advantage, okay, advantage. Then the other one, surf, so, surf, surf. And what was the other one? Awareness. And then enough, enough, okay, enough interest. Int rest, int rest. So interest, interest. As if we don't have this letter E between the T and the R. So we say, we don't say interest. We say interest, interest, interest. Uh, okay, I think that's it. Is there any question of what I said right now? A ver, pronunciémoslo todos, las palabras que fui diciendo. Empezamos con training courses. Training courses. Training courses. Training courses. Training courses. Developed. 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 Yes. Irrelevant. 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 Advantage. 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 advantage, advantage, very good. And then it was surf, so, surf, 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 surf. 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 Awareness. Awareness. awareness, enough, enough, enough. interest, interest. interest. Mm -hmm. Usually this one sounds like uh, interest, interest, yeah, interest. Mm -hmm. I think those are the words, right? Those are the words. Is there any other word that you are um, maybe a dot how to interest. pronounce it? Yeah, interest. Very good. Very good, Nelson. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A ver, ¿alguien tiene alguna pregunta de la pronunciación? Uh, 
Vamos bien hasta aquí. Uh, so far, so good. It's okay. All right. Now we are going to practice the conversation and the breakout rooms, and you are going to do the prayer work. And here you have to uh, answer the questions one, two, and three according to the conversation. Okay, so you it, this is a reading comprehension activity. So go back to the reading and then you complete this answering, okay? Answering these questions. Okay, then this is page 22. We're going to work right there. I don't know how to do because I have some listen as a listener. Okay, I will create them. There are 16 of us, so. Okay, we will recreate and we have too much people in the rooms. One second, because this is because of the listeners and I don't want to leave uh, only one person. I mean, one active person. So one second. Bien, no voy a tirar así, eh, los voy a abrir así, pero luego yo voy a ir haciendo los cambios, okay, para que no queden solitos. Por un momento pensé que iba a decir que está lo que Dios quiere. I'm sorry. Por un momento pensé que iba a decir los mandaré así que sea lo que Dios quiera. Ah no 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 <risa> yo no lo voy a dejar así no 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 no. Sí lo <risa> y sea lo que Dios quiera. <risa> Ay Miguel bueno. Yes, you may join. Edwin, are you able to join?
don't know where Ed, Ed, Edwin. Number three, I think the the liquidation is the access of our, our documentation. They're all trading courses online. The very online, Sell the training courses online. Hello. I think that the the answer are correct, but uh I, Como se dice, falta, falta el pronombre. Por ejemplo, what does Sofía wants to sell? She wants to sell training course online. But, yeah. Pero la respuesta está, es correcta, ¿verdad? Mm. Mm. La costumbre de hacerlo siempre. Uy. No puedo quitarlo, ¿verdad? Sí. Uh, buy the courses uh, into the 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 net the the web. Okay. Okay, man. Uh, do you want practice more? Okay. Sure. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like store to sell them. I think the place is actually relevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? Um, you could sell your training course online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create an awareness about your product first from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. Okay, man. Do you want to swap? Yes, yes, yes. I would like to sell training courses online. I had developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. Oh, I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? Uh, you could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them.
All right. Okay, people. So now, what is the answer for number one? Please read the question and say the answer. A ver, tomen iniciativa. Vamos. What does Sofia want to sell? Well, she wants to sell training courses online. Okay. Um, were they online from the beginning? Well, she's not sure if she yes. should get a place. Okay, Physical they were place. they were uh, a, um, training courses online. But she says, right, because that's the main product that she's create, she has created, and the name has online already, okay? So that's why this guy is offering some recommendations, right? So let's look at number two. Number two. Okay, number two. Elias? Am I muted? Hello? The second one. Uh -huh. Number two. What is she sure about? Mm -hmm. And say here, she's not sure if she could get a place like a store to sell them. Okay, if uh, she needs a physical place, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Correct. And what about number three, Eulise? Am I muted or something maybe? Hello? <laughs> no, I'm okay. Te escucho bien. <laughs> Oh, okay then. Thank you, Salvador. Yeah, I was thinking that was I, I was alone. <laughs> oh my God, you left me alone. Don't abandon me, guys. Okay, now um, we are in number three. So I asked Eulise. I don't know if he's available. Hello. Hello. Um, number three is uh, Arnold and uh, recommend. Recommend uh, recommendations. Uh, recommendation um uh, uh sell sell training training course online um mm -hmm. uh, people are always using their 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 phones uh, to sure the well and there are new things. Exactly. So um, she has to take the advantage. Of, I mean, she has to take advantage of that um, situation that everybody is on the net, right, through their phones. So they are trying to learn new things and they are involving in new courses time after time, right? Also, if you sell cooking classes, maybe you are going to sell them because it, there is always people, there are always people interested, okay? There are always people interested. Okay, mm, just one moment, please. No. Kevin, is there a problem, Kevin?
Okay, then let's continue with um, the promotion discussion, okay? With the promotion discussion. So let's think about one product, one product in the national market, okay? Everybody, let's think about a product that it's produced in El Salvador, but the brand is worldwide. And let's think about Coca-Cola, okay? Let's think about Coca-Cola. Uh, do you like Coca-Cola? Do you like drinking Coca-Cola? Oh. Okay, so I will send you a link and everybody watch this video, okay? Mm -hmm. Everybody watch this video. And you are going to tell me uh, what is, just one second. Teacher. Tell me. Eh, eh, paso lista. No, I didn't. Thank you very much. Eh, Thank you. I'm having problems with my internet and se cae y vuelve a caer por si sí, pasa lista para que oh okay okay and let's think about Coca Cola I lost this um this I, I will rather like coffee drink coffee oh okay <laughs> I would rather drink coffee. Okay, I will send. Watch this video. Okay, watch this video. And uh, it doesn't have any dialogue, it's a song. Okay, and you are going to see the changes or what's the approach? What is the message in this commercial? All right, everybody watching the video. Meanwhile, you're watching the video, I will call the attendance, all right? So remember that the requirements from Insaforp are that you have to turn your camera on and when I call your name, you say present. Alvaro Ernesto Aguilar Peñate. Ana Lorena Lobato Orellana. Present teacher. Thank you. Boris Alexander Cortez Cáceres. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto Domínguez Martínez. Present teacher. Okay. Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Present teacher. All right. Elías Neftalí Martínez González. Present, present teacher. Okay, thank you. Eulice Torres Torres. Present. Fatima Noemi Umaña Castro. Present. Okay. Jose Miguel Torres Hernández. Present teacher. Jose Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. I'm here, teacher. Great, Salvador. Eh, Josma Natilio Serrano. Present. Very good. Karen Lisset Sánchez Castro. Miss Karen. Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menendez. Present. Thank you, Kevin. Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejia. Here. Thank you. Rafael Alexander Serna Díaz. Present teacher. Okay. Santiago Roberto Calderón Avelar. Okay, I know you are joined. All right, Wilber Alberto Perez Mendez. Present teacher. 
Okay, thank you very much. Is there any question so far about the topic we are studying? What do you think about the video? What do you think about the video, uh, the Coca-Cola commercial? Now, tell back what you have seen in the video, okay? Tell back means that you are going to tell me what is going on in the video. So, what's the first scene? ¿Qué aparece en la primera escena? The first scene. I'm waking up in the morning. Aha, uh -huh. people waking up in the morning. Very good. And what time uh, is it? Well, at, at least around seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. And is kind of similar to your life? Do you wake up at seven? Do you get up at seven o'clock? I get up at uh, five o'clock. At five o'clock, oh, okay, yeah. all right. Now, if we compare, because they are making a comparison, they are making a comparison from the olden days with the nowadays, with nowadays. So remember, when we are making the comparison, we talk in the past simple tense, all right? And now the present tense. So let's combine this, let's combine this. You told me. Okay, they two couples, right? Two couples. They woke up at 7 a.m. What did they do after that? They, they had their breakfast. Breakfast. Okay, and what was on their plates? One like one side, uh, I forget the name. Bread. I'm sorry. With marmalada, bread with marmalada. Okay, toasts. Yeah. Uh huh. Toast. toast. And the and the other. Uh, Normally. Remember. Uh -huh. In the house for. In the house. In okay. the house. In the office. Ah, okay. They present how they live uh, or their activities in the house and their activities in the office. Okay, but what do you think is still similar in the two, um, in the two sides, the olden days and the present days? What is eating the, the bread and I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so breakfast were similar. Okay, breakfast are similar. similar. Okay, uh huh. And what about the dressing or the clothing they are wearing? It's the dress is it's, it's different. Totally different, right? Totally different. Yes. Uh huh. And what about the pace? The pace the speed with um, they do their activities? The last time is a, a how do you say, máquina de escribir, machine. Yes, writing machine. Mm -hmm. Writing machine. And the present is a computer. Okay, that's a typing machine. Typing machine and the typing computer. Machine. Okay, yeah. very different, right? Very different, totally yeah. different. And what about the time, the speed? The speed is slow, is so slow in, in the past. Okay, than actually. Uh -huh. in the past was lower. In the past was lower. Uh huh. And nowadays? It's really faster, right? Very quick. We don't have time for anything more than Cheetos and soda, okay? And a sandwich or maybe Subway or a hamburger, right? You don't have the time as they had going to the park and sit down and eat their lunch, enjoy 
the sightseeing, okay? Um, can you do that in these days? I, I mean, in your lunch time. In your lunch time, can you do that? Or now, can you describe what do you do in your lunch time? What do you do in your lunch time? Do you eat in your office? Yes, I am eat and in office. I eat. I eat in I my eat. office. I, uh -huh. I eat in my office. Okay, um, on your desk or on a cafeteria? Uh, uh, in my desk. On your desk. Oh my God. All right. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. We don't have much time, right? We don't have time to lose and we are working at the same time that we are eating. Uh, this is our current days, right? It's kind of speed, everything is quick, everything is for yesterday and we are running away and in a hurry and we are completely disorganized, right? Disorganized. Okay, now guys, what was the product they were advertising? What is the product they are advertising? What is the product? Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. Okay. Did you see Coca-Cola in the comparison? No, teacher. Just in, in, um, in finally. Yeah, it's, at the end. Uh -huh. At the end, it shows mm -hmm. that maybe in those days, it was not so popular, the Coca-Cola, right? But in these days, it's the same thing. In these days, it's the same thing with Coca-Cola. Okay, but now, um, allow me just to ask you some more questions. One second. Okay. What image come to your mind when you hear the word marketing and the word promotion? What imagine, imagine, I'm sorry. What images come to your mind when you hear those words? Mm -hmm. Okay, in my case, for example, when I hear marketing, I imagine a commercials. Okay, they come to my mind when I think about marketing. I think about commercials, advertisement. I think about the announcements on the newspaper. That's marketing for me. What is for you? What images come to your mind? Jose Miguel? I try to think something. <laughs> <laughs> okay, if I say we are going to talk about marketing, what comes to your mind? Could be newsletters about the product 
in okay. different places. Advertising. Very good. Advertising and uh, newsletters about the product information, right? Information. Yeah. Okay. So messages, messages through any channel, any channel of communication, right? We think about messages, concepts, um, brands, and images of products uh, everywhere, anywhere through the channels, right, of communication. Husband, what does, uh, I mean, what does marketing mean for you? Marketing teacher? Yes, marketing. Oh, okay. Um, marketing is the, for the promotion, the, the products, the different company, um, and that um, review the sale and, and, and view the products and view the price um, and different for. Okay, the product, the price, and the sales, right? The yeah. sales. Very good. Wilbert, what is marketing for you? I have no words exactly to explain that. Examples? But um, it could be access my classmate. Uh, it's a process uh, through the advice, advice, advancing. Mm -hmm. Taking uh, advantage of taking advantage. advantage. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, through the uh, advertising. Oh, yes. Advertising. Mm -hmm. It's completely related, right? Yes. Okay. To get, to get, the, uh, to get the, uh, the need of consumers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. And your companies, guys. Um, do you have a sales team, a team in charge of the selling of the product, the selling of products? Do you have a marketing team? Do you have a sales team in your in your company? Mm -hmm. What kind of strategy uh, does your company do for selling the products? What are the strategies they use? Do they sell person to person? Do they sell to a retailer? Do they produce the product? In my case, teacher in, the, in my company, uh, the for the marketing and different for, for example, the media, social media promotion and that uh, production that TV, uh, radio, um, uh, brochure, um, no sé cómo se dice, vallas publicitarias. The billboards. The billboards. Mm -hmm. And digital, and digital promotion in buyers. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, and, mm -hmm. and depend on the, the type of the, uh, campaign for example in this moment the campaign the the carles puyol uh the salvador in july mm -hmm. um and this is the company in this moment the company oh, okay they are using a figure right a public uh famous person and yeah. uh, yes like an image right like an image to promote your products very good very good so how much of marketing around yourself guys this is for example um on tv on the radio how much of this marketing um promotional messages that you have seen uh, do you think are uh, lying are lying how much of this marketing
or everything is true? What do you think? Is every, everything true in marketing? Teacher, I didn't understand the, the question. Okay, how much of this marketing is lying? This is according your opinion, okay? According to your opinion, how much of the marketing you have seen on TV on the, or by the radio or maybe the newspapers, do you think are lying? How much? All. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. In some cases, it depends on the product, for example, the food uh in the in the tv uh, we can see mm -hmm. uh, the food the delicious uh, big uh, uh, portions portion portion okay big portion yes portions uh, and um, como puede ser? For example, for the food and for the other products, uh, the 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 design change uh, when you see uh, in front the of the product. Uh, okay, mm -hmm. it's not the same what they offer in the commercial uh, than the thing that you are receiving. Yeah, okay. it's the bang of the product. For example. Okay. All right. What about pizza? For example, let's think about pizza. How much of the promotional uh, messages that you have received through any channel of communication is about pizza, right? Is lying. How much of this marketing is lying? Have you ever had this experience that you uh, order for something? thinking about that you are receiving something and at the time that you are receiving it, it's not the same. How much of this advertising is lying? Talking about pizza, let's uh, let's think about the brands of pizza here. They are Pizza Hut. Then we have a, I don't know if Toto's Domino's still in the market. Domino's Pizza, Toto's Domino's, Pizza, Papa uh -huh. Jones, uh, Papa uh, Jones. Viva Pizza, okay, Crispy Pizza. <laughs> I love the pizza. Okay, and exactly what you order is what you receive. Or for example, when you call and you say, uh, look, I want to order the menu number tall, number, number tall, number, I don't know, any number. Then you say, they say, oh yes, it costs $25. $25, but it says $20 in the message. Have you ever had that situation? Have you ever had that situation? And how do they explain it? How do they explain it? Knowing pizza, I have, I had a, that issue in Vidri. Oh. Uh, you surf on the web and you're looking for, for a, a toll. And when you see that uh, the toll has the, the price, but in a little letter, you 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 don't uh, you, write you uh, no, uh, you don't uh, read uh -huh. that little letter. It says only on light, but in prices it costs uh it's more expensive. Oh oh oh! So it, it, it happened. That. It happened with me because I said my boss, uh, this this is a. Uh, cheaper now uh -huh. so uh -huh. uh, we have to take a bunch uh -huh. uh, he told me it's okay go and okay. i went and when i arrived uh, at b3 
it was because quite expensive. It, uh, yes, it, it is it is a cheaper, but if you buy it online. Oh my goodness. <laughs> no yes. way. Yeah, something similar happened to me when I went to Pizza Hut. It was, I don't remember exactly. And they told me, no, that's only for delivery. It's not for restaurant. Oh my goodness. And I was thinking that I, I was going to pay the same as they were um saying in the promotional messages right or in the commercials and sometimes it happens it happens maybe they are not completely lying but they sometimes omit uh information for some reason right so this is very interesting so now guys now guys así espontáneamente vamos a pensar a ver yo voy a decir el nombre de una marca Y ustedes van a decir lo que se les ocurre de acuerdo a lo que han escuchado on TV or, mm, I don't know, on the radio, wherever, okay? Like the slogan or something, okay? Campolón. On TV. TV. <laughs> okay. Uh, anything that you heard about Campolón? Um, I heard in of the radio? about Campolón in the radio. <laughs> okay, uh-huh. Uh -huh. energy. <laughs> you got it, yes. Okay, <laughs> now I'm going to say La Nevería. Two for one. Two for one. Flyers. Two for one. Uh -huh. And what did you say, Wilbur? Thank you, Boris. Flyers. Flyers, okay. Uh, siempre hay un eslogan ahí que yo recuerdo casi siempre que dice, donde siempre hay dos, que por uno se derriten, right? So, something like that, yeah. <laughs> okay, vamos. Um, I will say the other one, it, what, uh, well. Uh, uh, Cos Café. Wow. Haven't the you? secret is the cube. <laughs> no sé cómo se dice. <laughs> the fume, <fuma>, good. <laughs> the smoke, no. <laughs> okay, nice. El secreto es el humito, yeah. <laughs> yeah, good. Uh -huh. No, okay. that's, that's not Musu. for Mutun. Is that Mutun? Uh -huh. Oh, my goodness. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, we bought Cos Café, Lorena. Yeah, we bought Cos Café, even though it was Mutun. Okay, I will say Australian. <laughs> Australian. Ooh, <laughs> okay, very good, very good. Okay, now, um, uh, let's say, a ver, Wilbert, díganos un producto y nosotros vamos a recordar, okay? So many products and I don't remember any, anyone. <laughs> a ver, Lore, Lore. Red Bull. Okay, I don't remember a product, a product. Let me think. Uh huh. Let's say anything. Let's say any product. Um, needle. Needle. Uh huh. Mm. I just remembered, Nido Crecimiento. Mejora tu crecimiento. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> yeah, Crecimiento, good. Aha. A ver, Hosman, a product. Pizza nada. Oh, God. Uh -huh. <laughs> entre Difficult amigos. product. No, entre amigos. Hey, guys, come on. Cochero. Between us. <laughs> Not drink <laughs> No, no, we don't drink, but maybe the no. commercials are around. Okay, the Coca-Cola. <laughs> okay, Coca-Cola, uh -huh. Coca-Cola. What's the slogan of Coca-Cola? Do you remember? Related to happiness, but I don't remember exactly. Ya no miramos. Oh, yes, something like that. Mm -hmm. Tell okay. us. 
Destapa la felicidad. Optan oh, happiness. good. Yeah, I, I remembered something about happiness, but that's uh -huh. good, Jose Miguel. Yeah, I remember the that. The other is, is the feeling. Oh, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Vale, ahora, sucaritas. Están riquísimas. Ah, ahí un tigre de ti, no era. Hay un tigre en ti, es que Exacto. mucha tele, y, y, y no, le ha, no le ha visto los backgrounds. Ah, okay. ahorita, quiero ver. Ajá. Ah, yo sé. A ver, ¿quién se acuerda de este número? Es A ver. 22577777, el número del sabor. <ríe> I, I know, hat. but I don't want to say, yeah, but it's a hat. It's a hat. <laughs> yeah, now let's think about Pollo Campero. Pollo Campero. Tierno, jugoso y crujiente. Okay, good. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Little Caesar. Hasta los gringos te lo quitan. Oh. <laughs> Hasta los gringos te lo quitan. <laughs> I know. Okay, let's say, bueno, las franquicias, right? Wendy's. Wendy's Tien. No sabía que tenía. Yeah, it has. It has one. I don't remember exactly. Fresh from... About the quality. Yeah, but it's fresh from the ingredients, fresh from something. Yeah. Fresh from something. When this, I only remember the, the melt. Subway? Uh, yeah, I remember. Subway, yeah, Subway, we... huh? On, on your way. Subway. And this, quality or receipt. Oh, yes. All, good, good. All uh -huh. fresh. All fresh. All, all fresh. fresh. All, all fresh. Okay, yes. Uh -huh. so, Little, yes. Caesar. Little Caesar. Little Caesar. Already. Pizza, pizza. pizza. pizza, pizza. <laughs> pizza, pizza. Already, pizza, pizza. Yes. Okay, Bacaolinita. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. Bacaolinita. Ya se ve y contento. No. It was. Bacaolinita nos da fuerza. Nos pone. Yo tomé bastante Bacaolinita, miren. <laughs> Uh-huh. Nos pone gorditas y muy chapuditas. Yeah. A ver, ¿qué hace? Ajá. Uh -huh. Otro que no es restaurante. A ver. Almacén es la nueva milagrosa. Oh, yeah, you got it. You got me. I don't remember. I don't remember. Hiper Europa. Hiper Europa? Well, now it is Walmart, right? Now it is Walmart. Kismet. Kismet, yeah. So we remember the brands because of the promotion. Ro what about rolling. Pepsi? Rolling in New York because New York. they were too, right? Uh huh. They were too. Uh huh. That's good. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> yes, you got us. Yes. Uh huh. Tapachulteca. Oh, Taco Plast, right? Taco Plast. Do you remember the, the, um, these, well, they were different kind of toys. Taco Plast toys. Is, is a company. Yes, it is. Of plastics, right? Yes. Uh huh. And they had these, se llamaban estas muñecas, ¿cómo se llamaban estas muñecas? Roxana. Con Roxana, yeah. con Roxana, <laughs> con muñecas de verdad. Ajá, okay. uh -huh. exacto. <laughs> Roxana. You see, through the TV, through the, um, eh, let's say, radio, those were the massive or the mass media that they used before. Eh, they our attention and they make an impact in our minds okay in our minds they buy our minds right they make us to believe that that's the product we need that's what promotion is aimed to that's what the main purpose of promotion strategies uh, come to the game okay they make us 
acquire the product, acquire the product. Even though if you don't acquire it because you don't need it, they create the necessity or they create the need of um, for you to buy it, for you to buy it. Maybe you are not going to use it or you are not going to buy it, but you recommend it. You pass the message to another person because you heard it, because you saw it, because you read it. So it's really important that we use the promotion strategies um, as an advantage, okay? As an advantage of our product, of our service that we offer. So now, así, espontáneamente, espontáneamente, creemos un... Eh, es, un mensaje, ¿verdad? Como un eslogan, un spot ahorita para el Telipton, digamos. Nosotros le queremos crear a Telipton una, un mensaje para que todos lo recuerden. A ver, vamos. Naturalmente refrescante. Oh, good. Very good. Uh -huh. Ok. Vaya, ahora creémosle así espontáneamente a una empresa que vende sombrías fashion, unas sombrías deslumbrantes. ¿Sí? Pensemos cómo le po podemos hacer ese concepto y ese mensaje para pasárselo a la gente, pero que se les pegue. Umbrellas. Umbrellas. That's Lorena, naturally refreshing. Naturally refreshing. Okay. Uh -huh. What about umbrellas? But very fashion, a fashionable. Maybe wear. keep keep your style on dar, darkness day. Oh, <laughs> good, good. For your cloudy days, right? Yeah, very good. Uh -huh. That's related with emotions for your great days, right? Good. Uh -huh. That's very good. Okay, now let's think about a product like... Um, let, um, you are the marketing team of... Um, let's say el Café Musun that you said, okay, Café Musun. Ustedes son el equipo de marketing de Café Musun. ¿Qué mensaje creen que podrían hacer que todo El Salvador diga, eh, qué barba, qué campaña, ¿verdad? O sea, no van a decir qué campaña, pero por lo menos se van a acordar, ¿verdad? Okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oops. Battery, battery, low battery. Huh? From the file to to your home. From the file or campo. From the campo to casa. Okay, but repeat the word. From file. Uh, can to, you spell it? Home. Can you spell that word? Maybe. Feel. Uh -huh. F -I -F -E oh, okay. Feel. Okay, let's say country better. Countryside. Countryside in the, in, instead of the field. Mm -hmm. Countryside. To your house, okay. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué le agregamos? Can we add something to that message? At the beginning, um, could be always with you. Okay, always with you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or in the end, about that, the uh, Wilbur says. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. So tomorrow we're going to do just a little bit this exercise. Uh, vamos a hacer los grupos y ustedes van a crear una, una campaña publicitaria, por decir así, pero en, 
con las estrategias que ustedes decidan, ¿verdad? Pero eso sí, el mensaje sí lo van a crear mañana, creativamente, ¿verdad? Se va a ser creativo. Así que, are we, um, ¿estamos todos listos? Voy a pasar lista. Please turn your camera on, and when I call your name, you say present. By the way, guys, what date is it today? Today is Wednesday, May 13th, uh, 2023. All right. Uh -huh. Today is Tuesday, May. May. The 30th, 30th uh -huh, of uh -huh, 2023. Of 2023. Remember, May the 30th. May, May the 30th. 30th. May the 30th. Mm -hmm. the of 2023. Estamos acostumbrándonos a decirlo completo. Ya después lo vamos a decir solamente May the 30th. Okay. May 30th, okay, something mm -hmm. like that. But no, we are gonna say it completely. Today is Tuesday, May the 30th of 2023. Okay, are you guys ready? Álvaro Ernesto Aguilar Peñate. We miss Álvaro, I don't know what happened with him. Hello, Santiago. Welcome. Hello. Is he, is I, am, I am hearing you, but uh, I, I have a meeting. But, uh, oh, all right. I am in Mexico, but I am here. Okay, I can great. Hear you, so. Welcome. Yeah. Welcome. All right. Ana Lorena Lobato Orellana. Present teacher. Boris Alexander Cortez Cáceres. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto Domínguez Martínez. Present teacher. Carlos Ernesto Hernández Cepeda. Edwin Antonio Quintero Sumaña. Present teacher. Elias Neftalí Martínez González. Present teacher. Eulice Torres Torres. Fátima Noemí Umaña Castro. José Miguel Torres Hernández. Present teacher. José Salvador Bernal Quintanilla. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Josman Atilio Serrano. Present. Karen Iset Sánchez Castro. Kevin Alfredo Lucero Menéndez. Present. Nelson Alberto Peraza Mejía. Present. Rafael Alexander Serna Díaz. Present teacher. Santiago Roberto Calderón Avelar. Present teacher. Ok. Wilber Alberto Pérez Méndez. Present teacher. Ok. Entonces, la cita para hoy es para Mr. Hosman. Ok. You want to stay? Yeah. Ok, great. So, guys. See you tomorrow. Have a very good night. Please do your homework. Uh, you have to finish to 2.14. Okay, this week we have to finish to 2.14, but you can work in advance. Mar Miguel okay, sent it, uh, his complete file, all right? So, yeah, great for you, Miguel. All right, people, see you tomorrow. Everybody, see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. See you. See you. Bye. Bye. Teacher. Tell me. Teacher, fíjese que ayer tuve un problema eh, a las 9.45 cuando pasamos al, a las salas. Uh -huh. Ya después no me, no me pude conectar al grupo y no me pude conectar a, a, nuevamente a la clase. Oh, ok. Sí, porque ya no escuché eh, ayer su, su, su nombre al final, ¿verdad? Ajá. Ok. Y, y fíjese que ahora otra vez casi me pasaba lo mismo, pero me ha quedado, me quedó en negro nuevamente la, la, 
-huh. La app, la app nuevamente, uh -huh. de Zoom. Entonces, solo tengo permitido usar el micrófono y pues no me da lo de la cámara, pero creo que oh. tengo, falla en el, tengo falla en el modem ahorita, entonces me va a tocar que reportarlo. ¿Podría ser eso o podría ser la nueva actualización de Zoom? A veces pasa eso. Hay que irse y ver si está actualizado y si no, instale las, las updates, las actualizaciones. Ok, teacher. Solo, solo le quería notificar nada más. Ok, thank you, Carlos. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you for letting me know. Ok, thank you, teacher. All right. Have a very good night. Thank you. Ok, goodbye, Santiago. Ok, here we are, Hosman. How are you tonight? How do you feel? I'm fine, teacher. Good. Great. Is there any question so far that I can help you with? Uh, no, uh, really. Uh, need this moment, the grandma. Um, And the, the class very interesting the, the, the module because okay. the very uh, more the practice and conversation and new vocabulary and in Spanish uh, I I get yeah, the significa signification because the, the translation the translation and and speaking in English is very different. And, oh yes. Uh, Yeah, on my case, and I, I practice and and um, and, and good the the comes uh, saber manejar el tema. Okay, to uh, let's say to master or to understand the yeah. topic. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the topic um is very very interesting um. And the unlike the this module that the the um the, the begin the mod the unit one very very important. Oh yes, and you work in the sales team of your company. Do you work in the yeah. sales team? Oh, this is why because it's really yeah. um the real your reality. It's your yeah. reality. Uh, Very good. Mm -hmm. I am. I, I. In my case, is the manager, the 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 agency in Sonsonate. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm really other the department department. Uh, because the the view and participation, the different activities. In my case, in the in the in my store, mm -hmm. I I responsible that the complete the, the um meet meta hey, goal. Goal. Or goal or goal mm -hmm. okay i it is it, necessary the the hell of the different the different department for example oh, the, yes for example the shop uh marketing is very important for me the different promotion that the storm um Um, this concept uh, is very familiar for me. Okay, it's really familiar. All right, yeah. very nice. And how um, how have been the the um, the homework? Have you had any trouble doing homework and the platform? No, uh, the the finish that the mirror the two to two element finish, the number three and four, the order, the order, the unary two and one finish. Oh, okay, yeah. The, the, the finish, yeah. The, That's very good. The, um, But husband, I was checking that you had, you didn't have the 100% in the number two and a unit two. Allow me to, to check it because I remember something I was going to tell you about it. One second, Hosman. Okay. Oh yes, you have the one hundred. Uh huh. One hundred, and then for you need to. Did you finish two point fourteen? 
Mm, I'm yeah, going um, to our, double check. Yeah, uh, in the minute, the number four, the problem is last question. Mm -hmm. Okay. Aha, uh -huh, because you got only 96. I don't know why, uh, why was it? Maybe it was only one sentence, the one that you missed. So if you go to 2.12, maybe you are going to have some trouble with the number five, no, number two, if I'm not wrong. Number two, si usted va a la 2.12, yo creo que en la número eh, dos, En la, en la oración número dos, creo que ahí le, le faltaría y así gana el 100, porque ahí había un error, no es de, eh, no había que poner enough, sino que hay que poner great, great features and benefits. Oye, okay. ajá, okay. lo revisa y ahí lo pone, porque yo creo que esa es la que le falta, según estoy viendo acá. Y sí. por eso le ha bajado los cuatro, los cuatro centésimas, uh -huh. o sea, no sí, porque esa es la que vale como, creo que cinco puntos, creo que vale cada uno. Ajá. Pero solo esa. So it's okay, it's okay. Please double check and try to um, type in, instead of enough, you are going to write great features and benefits. Okay. Okay. And yesterday we solved that a homework with I don't remember if it was with Elias uh, no recuerdo con quien fue que lo hicimos pero ya lo hicimos con José Miguel, ya lo hicimos con Elias ya lo hicimos con varios para que lo vaya a ver en la sesión uno a uno ok uh -huh. Voy a buscar. ok Perfecto. solo Gracias. eso es en vez de enough va a poner great creo que es la great. número dos ajá, es la número dos uh -huh. ok Bien, y de ahí las demás eh, estamos bien porque solo esos cuatro puntitos le faltan. Sí. All right, then uh, we are going to build the vocabulary tomorrow about the promotion um, price. I'm sorry, the product price, place, and promotion strategies. We are going to make like a mix tomorrow. All right, okay. and. Be prepared because tomorrow you you have to be creative. You are going to create a promotional message, all right? So think okay. about a promotional message. Maybe you can get any of the products that you have in your company to sell and think about what will be a very good message, okay? Yeah. Very good. Uh, like okay. a commercial, right? Like a commercial. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, then, um, is there any other thing I can help you with? Not teacher for women. It's so good. Okay, okay, <laughs> then. Then I think we're finished and see you tomorrow, Osman. See you tomorrow, teacher. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye.